Well, you guys got another video here for you. Why does Microsoft keep doing this? This is another rant video and showing you basically the workarounds that you have to do for something simple uh, like pinning a folder to the taskbar in Windows 11. It's not possible and Microsoft don't want you doing it. But I created a little tools folder here and I said I'd make a video on showing you how to pin a folder to your taskbar. Some people wanted to know how to do it, so I thought make a quick video and also turn it into a bit of a rant video because this should not be happening to an operating system like pinning a folder to the taskbar. It used to be so easy to do and Microsoft are making it ridiculously hard to actually pin a folder to the taskbar. So I've changed this tools folder here back to a default folder so you can see what we've got to do. We're going to right click on it and send to the desktop and create a, a shortcut basically for this particular folder to our desktop. Years ago, you used to be able to just pin something to the taskbar, but now Microsoft, in their infinite wisdom, don't want you pinning folders to the taskbar. So here we have a shortcut here and we can now right click on this and go to properties on the shortcut folder. This is what you have to do if you want to pin something to your taskbar. Now we have a target path right here of our shortcut folder here. And what we need to do is put explorer.exe and space in the front of that path or target. You can see right here, that's all I've done. We can apply this and OK, and that's now completed. So if we click on the folder, the shortcut folder to our tools folder, which is in the documents area, you can see it still works perfectly fine. So now we can right click on our shortcut folder on the desktop and pin this to the taskbar. Why has Microsoft made such a simple task so difficult? You can pin other things to the taskbar, but you can't pin a folder to the taskbar. You have to jump through hoops to get things done. And that's what Windows 11 is. Most people don't like the start menu. You have to use software to change the start menu. And there's also uh, people that want to customize Windows. So they have to use software uh, to basically change things on Windows. And there's also tons of bloat and telemetry and other things that people don't like. They've taken away things that people use. And now they're phasing out things like the control panel and other things on Windows as well, which have been around for, you know, 15 to 20 years people have been using it and now all of a sudden they're taking those options away same as these icons here these have been around for god knows how long and they haven't even updated things like this so anyway that's a little bit of a rant video uh, for how to pin a folder to the taskbar where they've made it so difficult and again you can change the icon here like i've just done and pin that you have to repin it but again, that's now done, and now you've got it pinned to you, basically to your taskbar like so. Sorry for the quick video today. Not had much chance to uh, make videos because I've been uh, going to the hospital and stuff. But other than that, I'll get back to normal, hopefully very soon, and uh, be able to make normal videos. But hopefully this one should help people who want to pin a folder to their taskbar in Windows 11. That's basically how you can do it. Anyway, that's going to be about it. I just want to quickly mention why people feel so compelled to correct others about their spelling, punctuation or pronunciation in the comments section. It's pretty rude and I just think people need to just understand that not everyone is cut from the same cloth. We're all different and just respect that. And if you are going to correct someone, at least do it in a proper manner rather than being rude. Anyway, that's going to be about it for this one. Rant over. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to my YouTube members who join my YouTube members group. I appreciate the support. I shall catch you in the next video or I'll see you on the Discord server for a chat. Bye for now.